Hey there! Welcome to Power Process Electrical Engineering Tech. Today we will know how to work PLC function block diagram. First, make sure you subscribe me and like the video. The function block diagram, FBD, is one of the graphical programming languages used in programmable logic controllers, PLCs. FBD is based on the concept of function blocks, which are reusable software components that encapsulate specific functionality. These function blocks can be interconnected to form a control program. Here's how FBD works. Identify the required function blocks. Determine the functionality you need to implement in your PLC program. Identify the appropriate function blocks available in the PLC programming software or library that correspond to the required functionality. Common function blocks include timers, counters, comparators, arithmetic operations, and communication blocks. Drag and drop function blocks. Open the FBD editor in the PLC programming software. Locate the function block library or toolbox that contains the desired function blocks. Drag and drop the required function blocks from the library onto the FBD editor. Connect function blocks. Use connecting lines or wires to establish connections between the function blocks. Each connection represents the flow of data or signals between the function blocks. Connect the output of one function block to the input of another function block to create the desired logic flow. Set parameters and configure function blocks. Double-click on a function block to open its properties or configuration dialog. Set the necessary parameters, such as time intervals for timers, counting values for counters, or thresholds for comparators. Configure the function blocks according to your specific requirements. Add input and output connections. Define the input signals or variables required for your program. Connect these inputs to the appropriate function blocks to control their behavior. Similarly, define the output signals or variables and connect them to the corresponding function blocks. Test and validate. Once you have created the desired function block diagram, save your program. Upload or download the program to the PLC hardware. Test the program by simulating or running it in the PLC. Verify that the expected functionality is achieved and that the program operates as intended. It's important to note that the specific implementation and features of FBD may vary depending on the PLC programming software and manufacturer. Refer to the documentation and guidelines provided by the manufacturer for detailed instructions and best practices when working with a particular PLC system. Thanks for watching.